Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So this video is my January favorites because it's already February 2nd. Um, so I'm just going to show you just a few beauty products that I use, um, currently use for the whole month of January and um, some brand new stuff that I got. So first off would be um, my two foundations which would be the Maybelline Fit Me in 230 and then um, the Revlon Color Stay in 150 bucks. So when I bought this one, um, it was a little bit darker on my skin tone. It was perfect for when it's summertime, but it's too dark for me um, during winter time, but I wanted to use it anyway. But then, uh, so I bought the Revlon one, but this one was too light for me. So I ended up just mixing these two together and um, the color uh, payoff of it um, ended up being my skin tone color. So these are like my go-to um, drugstore foundations compared to my matte velvet one. So this one is just like a here and there uh, foundation that I use, but these are my everyday foundations. So that would be for the foundation. Um, another thing that I use for my face would be the NYC, another drugstore product, um, Blue's Face Powder. So I recently just got this in the beginning of the month of January, and then I, I started using it more um, towards every single day because the one that I used before was the Makeup Forever one, and then, um, which, this one is just a cheaper alternative, and um, this is like $2 or something like that, so this one, and it works just as great as my little Makeup Forever um, loose powder, translucent powder, yeah. Translucent powder. And then another obsessions of mine would be my color tattoos. These ones, um, like I said, they're really, really easy to to blend with. They're easy to apply. Like the ones that I have on my lid right now is the two cool one, the white one. And um, I love these. These are like so awesome. And I finally got the last color that I was looking for, bold, for which is that Audacious Asphalt. So I have all of the uh, Maybelline color tattoos, so that they just asphalt looks like that. So I'm excited that I have all of them. And then um, in my makeup bag that I keep in here all the time is, where is it? Would be my MAC Love Lorne um, lipstick, and it's a luster finish. And this is the one that I have on my lips right now. And it's just a really, really, really pretty pink. And I love this color. This just, this doesn't even leave my makeup bag. So it's really, really um, pretty as well. And then another lipstick that I have is a Revlon brand. This one is a pearl finish. It's 120, 120 Apricot Fantasy. Wow, I cannot talk. So it looks, um, that's, I don't know why I won't focus. But that's the color. This is the color. And let me do a really quick swatch so you guys can see. So it's like a orangey, peachy color. And this pretty much goes, um, stays in my purse as well. When I did the, my last video and I said I couldn't find my other lipstick, this is the um, lipstick that I couldn't find. So I love this color. So that's one's going to stay in my makeup bag as well. And another MAC product that I use is um, my Studio finished concealer in NC20 and this is what I use for my under eye concealer just put it on there then put like a little powder on top of it and then um, another powder that I use just to touch up my face would be the mineralized skin finish also by MAC and mine's almost done so mine looks like that so I've hit the pan really bad um, and this one is in medium so this is another favorite of mine. And then when I do my eyebrows, I also have another um, MAC Studio Concealer thing, but that's just to fix like my eyebrows. Um, so it looks like that is a little bit darker than the other one that I have, but I don't put that in my makeup bag. And then another favorite that I have would be my Smoky Lash um, by Makeup Forever Mascara. And I love this, this is like, awesome like I can't explain it but um, it came with the little kit like this that I bought at Sephora and obviously I took out the lab shine and the um, makeup forever 
high definition how high definition powder I can't talk today what the heck is going on but I haven't taken out the other ones but I've used this one already and this one is really really pretty as well so that would be that and then another favorite of mine, and I know it's mostly everybody's favorite, of course, would be my Naked Palette. Um, I pretty much use this every single day for my neutral eyes, and I love, 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 love times 50. I love this palette. This palette is so awesome, and I'm so glad that I have it. And then another one that I just started using recently, I know this, I just got this like last Saturday, but I've been using it so far, and I would include it in my favorites video because I know for a fact that for my next favorites video, this would be part of it, but I might as well just include this one. But I, um, on my eyes today, I used the pistol, and then um, the other day I used booty call. So all the names are like in the back of the thing. These have really funny names. I don't know. So <laughs> that would be that. Another favorite thing of mine would be the NYC Sunny Bronzer. I use that just to contour my face every single day. And as a blush, um, I do like the Dream Bounty Blush. It's, I don't think it's hard to work with. Um, this is the only one that I have. I haven't um, gotten the other ones, but this one I really, really like. It makes my um, cheeks like, uh, I don't know, like as if it's my, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but it's really, really pretty on my cheeks, so I really like this one. And last but not least, my um, another drugstore product would be my NYC's um, Brow Kit. And this one is in Brunette. And this is the one that I use every single day for my eyebrows. Along with my Mary Kay um, brown pencil that I can't find in my makeup bag. So I use this every single day for my eyebrows. So that is it. Oh, one thing. Or two things actually. I love this um, flat top brush that I got at Target from Elf, and I use it every day just to buff my uh, my translucent powder into my foundation. And then just to set it off, I use my Makeup Forever mm -hmm. Mist and Fix spray. So just to top off everything on my face. Yeah. So anyways, um, that would be that. That would be my January's favorite video. Uh, if you guys have any requests on anything and um, have any questions, just leave a comment or leave an inbox message or anything like that. And I will see you guys on my next video. So I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day. Bye.